Hello everyone, my name is Jennifer Pademski. I am an actor, producer, writer, director, born and raised in Toronto. I now make my home and raise my family in Barrie, Ontario, and I am happy to be here today to tell you a little bit about myself. My mother is from Muscopeding First Nation in Saskatchewan. She's Anishinaabe, and my dad is from Israel. Um, and he is, well, Israeli, Jewish. I was born, obviously, mixed race. And I have to say, after many years of uh, identity crisis and working through that, I've really, I really feel that I've found my voice and my place in the world and feel very purposed to be telling stories through an Indigenous lens and raising up and amplifying voices from my community, my Indigenous community. Um, so many of those that came before me in my own family even uh, have, have been and were silenced over several generations. And I feel like my passion for storytelling and my passion for performing really um, provided me with the opportunities to utilize the platform to exclusively focus on raising Indigenous voices and perspectives in the media um, and the content we consume. What I am most proud of in my career is I've been able to be a part of a, a few really exciting projects. Um, I guess the first, the first thing would be my first production company, Big Soul Productions, um, was was started in 1999 with Laura Milliken and we were pretty alone in the field at the time. We were, we were an indigenous female run production company, full service. Um, and we created television series, documentary content, narrative, um, fiction, uh, moccasin flats was the first dramatic TV series to star an entirely indigenous cast and to be, created by and for Indigenous people. I'm really proud of that. Really proud of Empire of Dirt over here, and uh, uh, which is a film that took about nine years to make, but we finally made it, starring three Indigenous women, um, a story about intergenerational trauma. And we were really recognized for that film, uh, written by Shannon Masters. Um, I have a lot to be proud of. It's It's been a long it's been a long career. I've been doing this for 30 years and uh, we have a long way to go. The industry um, is still very stuck in, in old paradigms, um, but I, I believe strongly that those paradigms are shifting and um, our voices and, you know, fellow, fellow underrepresented voices, black people of color, um, LGBTQ voices are beginning to be heard and, we are we are working in solidarity with each other to ensure that we take up more space. Um, so thanks for listening and have a good indigenous indigenous history month. <laughs>